Hey guys, Gassa TV here with another Path of Exile a leak starter suggestion video for 3.14 Ultimatum. In this one, we're going to talk about the Soul Rust build. I'm going to go through the uh, some of the minor changes that has happened, and um, they're not much, but they're mostly buffs. Cluster jewels for higher end budget builds has been minor nerfed, uh, been some small minor nerfs to it, uh, nothing too dangerous. One of the buffs to this is mainly the fact that we are able to drop the Soul Rust staff outside of delving counters. So this should logically and realistically result in the staff becoming cheaper earlier than it does in normal leagues. Uh, in the previous leagues, we have seen the Solar staff become rather expensive in the first two to maybe up to three days before they crash down to very, very cheap prices. Now with this change, there might they should be a lot cheaper earlier. But the item itself becomes very cheap very fast in the in the game, and you can play with SRS or Spectres or Skeletons, depending on how you feel, till you get yourself a Solar staff. It's not a problem to leak start with on day one. It's something I've done in the past as well. It is an amazing build to play. I've enjoyed this a lot. If you go for high body with it, you can actually shit off, uh, shit down on what do you call it? You can shit on uh, end game bosses very reliably, but it's been a very comfortable clearing build as well. And depending on which approach you take from the build guide, you're able to get some pretty juicy defensive stats out of it as well. It is definitely a build that I personally enjoyed playing a lot and um, definitely worth checking out. It's a very solid league starter build, and I think it will work very well for encounters such as the Ritual Encounters, which is basically what Ultimate League will be. It will be a bit harder encounters of Ritual, where you go through waves of enemies, where you will already be able to pre-cast and re pre summon your minions, as well as the usage of Vault Summon Skeletons, if you wish, to have a large chunk of minions soaking up aggro from the enemies and just bursting them down with that sick AoE damage, which also works very well for endgame bosses. So I think this build can be very fun to play in the upcoming League. If you do decide to play it, let me know in the descriptions below. And do, don't forget to check out the build guide linked in the description below as well, which has everything added that you need to know, as well as a gearing section added where you can actually see a link into my crafting hub where you can learn to craft basic one-on-one -on -one crafting items, as well as specific items that you can use for this build and many others. And that's about it. I don't really have much to say about this build. It's super straightforward. This is a really short video. Anyways, if you like these short videos where I do an update of my build guides and go through the pros and cons of the changes for the upcoming league, let me know in the comments below and I'll keep doing them. Until next time, stay safe, keep rocking.